you ask me, it is a tragedy that this country should have somebody of the caliber of Mr. Gachagua as a deputy president. Mr. Gachagua should not even be ahead of a chicken pen. Because of his, his conduct, the way he behaves, uh, the, and the way he talks, he talks with so much contempt to the rest of the country. It's as if he's a deputy president for Mount Kenya only. Other parts of the country do not exist in as far as he's concerned. When he talks to me as we and you, uh, meaning my people uh, and his people, and yet he's supposed to be the deputy president of the Republic of Kenya, and even has the impudence to go and say that Kenya is a, 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 a corporation mm -hmm. or a shareholders company, that there are some communities with more shares, others with fewer shares, others with others no, with shares. no shares yes. at all. Eh? That uh, those ones with no shares have nothing to expect from our government. You see? Uh, he forgets that the same government which he, is, uh, is, uh, he runs collects taxes from all over the country on a daily basis. And then he tells them, you are not shareholders. Mm -hmm. So what are they doing in Kenya? So when we talk of self-determination, there's good reason. Mm -hmm. uh, even the Gachagwa is not censored. And I've asked Mr. Ruto publicly to censor his deputy. Because, you know, it is uh, um, an insult mm -hmm. uh, to the, the country. Uh, if he now, for example, goes with him, to Western Kenya, to, 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 the, to the coast, to, to Nyanza, uh, when he does not recognize those people as shareholders uh, in, in the country. Okay? And, and uh, you remember, Mr. Kachagwa had a criminal case which has been removed, removed just like some of those others. He's the one who is now talking about corruption. Okay? So, uh, th this government cannot fight corruption. Mm -hmm. It is itself a product of corruption. Okay, I'd like to talk about 